Hey, it's Chun Time and this is Cooking Avenue. Today we're going to be demoing this new tea by Way Laboratories. It's called Golden Flower Herbal Tea. And it's really good for your lungs. Get some circulating, heat it up so that you're working like prime time during chime time. <laughs> and that's how I work with it. And it's recommended to have this thing two to three times a day at one teaspoon. So if, if you're uh, in your house and you're wondering what is a teaspoon, it's the smaller spoon. If you got the big spoon, that's a tablespoon. This is the teaspoon. So the idea is that you just scoop it and throw it directly into hot water, maybe stir it up a bit. So the ingredients to golden flower tea are Flos Losincre, Milk Vect Root, Weeping for Cynthia, Capsule Dried Tangerine Peel, and Casey Twig. And I think Casey is similar to cinnamon, which it has a really nice cinnamon smell. So it comes in this tin, well, it doesn't come in the tin, it comes in a plastic bag and you kind of got to empty it into the tin. The tin isn't the best, so if you have one, of like of your own, I'd say empty it in there. But it's got like a very sawdust-like look. And that's probably because there's so many different ingredients in here. And it's very chocolatey, very fine. Um, it'll coat your tongue a bit when you're drinking it, especially at the bottom. So when you are drinking it, you're gonna wanna like swirl the mug around in between sips, especially like the deeper you get into it. So this is my favorite mug. This is Mud Love. It went to a uh, charity donation, getting lesser privileged people water. But it's just the right size. It's like eight ounces. So you're gonna wanna pour your piping hot water in here. And grab the teaspoon. I mean, we did screw up earlier, like we had been like putting them in our tea diffusers, but because we finally read the instructions, we're gonna try it for the first time, doing a teaspoon. And remember, this is like two to three times a day. I think that's healthy. A little bump on there, pour it in, let it sink in for a while. This is usually like what my tea looks like sitting on top, or when I do like, cordyceps but it usually soaks in this doesn't soak in too much so i'm gonna stir it up get a nice swirl in there not spill too much and i mean like if you are sipping debris like either way your body is going to digest it well enough and if you don't like to sip too much debris i'd say put it inside here so like, shoot, let's just do both. We got two mugs. Let's see how that goes. So like, I just scoop directly in here. There's like some chunky pieces. I'll try to get a chunky piece in there for you. So like, there's like a twig. By the way, hold your hand underneath here because it's gonna like, the powder goes right through. But. You know, stick it over here. And then uh, just teabag it a bit. Close it up and if you could zoom in over here um and this is how both variations are gonna look and it's supposed to be really healthy for you I, I guess if you're gonna do it this way you know like a teaspoon directly in just keep the teaspoon with you so you can keep stirring you do get a bit of junk in your mouth <laughs> But it's very like kind of watery on the bottom and maybe I don't know and then this version is way smoother so like 
I mean, the instructions say to put it directly in, but I think it's up to you. Like you could, you're gonna consume the ingredients more if you put it right in. You're gonna consume the ingredients less, but the hot steeping is gonna get a lot of the beneficial nutrients out of the contents uh, or like the herbs. So, you know, try both, see what you like more. Uh, if you dislike one or the other, but want to, or if you dislike the original way and you wanna try like the baby way, I guess, <laughs> uh, do both, you know, like switch it up, do this, the annoying way once in a while and do the uh, baby way the other way, you know, the other rest of the time. <laughs> Best of luck to you. This is, uh, what's the name of the show? This is, this is Cooking Avenue with Chime Time. Love you so much.